Guys, I don't know why this is happening, but I'm getting sued by Eddie VR. Yes, the big YouTuber. I got the letter right here, guys. And I really don't know what to do with this. This is scary. Make sure to stay to the end of this video so it might have some valuable information so you can avoid a lawsuit as well. So on my channel, as you know, I have some gaming videos, a lot of tutorials, and occasionally some sketches on my channel. And for my entertainment, I usually watch like Laserbeam or Fearless. And of course, I watch a lot of other YouTubers as well. Like I watch Ninja for gaming and a lot of other YouTubers. So a while back, I was watching Laserbeam. And then as soon as I finished the video, some other recommendation showed for some other YouTube called YouTuber called Eddie VR. And the video title was called Face Your Fears Like a Mexican. I clicked the video and it was actually actually pretty funny. Then I started to watch some of his videos. Obviously I watch other YouTubers as well, but he also curses in Mexican, but that's the funny part about it. And even after this situation, I still think he's a great creator. He actually landed on trending a few times and he's a really funny creator. Since I make occasionally sketches, I got an idea. Maybe I can make an Eddie VR sketch. So I made a sketch like a little brother watches Eddie VR for the first time. And if you want to see the video, the link is in the description down below. In the beginning, the video got normally 100 to 150 views. Obviously, that's normal. Just recently, that sketch almost got to 5,000 views. I know 5,000 is not a lot of views, but for me, it's a lot. And just to put it to perspective, check the video out. I did not copy any of Eddie VR's materials. I mean, sure, I might have said a few lines, maybe his lines, but those are regular Spanish words. But definitely, I didn't copy any part of his video. So now I'm going to read you the letter. On the top, it says cease and desist document. And it says March 24th, 2020. That's the date they sent it. I think that's like a week ago. And it says Chris GTX videos. I obviously cannot read my dad's name for obvious reasons. And then it says email and address. I don't know how they got the address or email, but let's just carry on. And the letter says, Dear Chris GTX videos and ch channel owners management, I'm writing on behalf of Eddie VR's channel owner to notify you that your channel unlawful copying of Eddie VR's channel, materials on your channel, and specifically on video titled, watches Eddie VR for the first time and this happens, at Eddie VR, infringes on Eddie VR's exclusive copyrights. Accordingly, you are hereby directed to cease and desist copyright infringement materials. Eddie VR's copyrights have been in effect since the day his channel and videos were created. The Eddie VR's channel original work. We have all the evidence of such materials to preserve for in evidence. Your actions constitute copyright infringement in violation of United States copyright laws. Under 17 USC 504, the consequences of copyright infringement include statutory damages between $750 and $30,000 per work. Guys, as you saw, I did nothing wrong. And all I did, I just said a couple funny lines that he said. To be honest, I actually admire him in the video, so I don't know what's going on. At discretion of the court and damages of $150,000 per work for willing full infringement. If you continue to engage in copyright infringement after receiving this letter, your action will be evidence of willing full infringement. Guys, do you hear that? It says you can be fined up to $150,000 per work. I don't have that kind of money. I'm a kid. Well, obviously, my dad will have to deal with this situation, not me, but that's just crazy. And finally, it says, should you have any questions, please contact your law firm by mail 
One April Fool's Lane. Happy April Fool's Day! <laughs> yeah, I was gonna do an April Fool's prank one year ago, but I didn't know what to do. So here's your April Fool's prank, prank from me, guys. Obviously, people actually like sue people on YouTube, so thank God I didn't get sued. And one advice, please don't copy anyone's content or if, to avoid a lawsuit. Make sure to check Eddie VR's channel. It's an amazing channel and, and I'll assure you it will make you laugh. But one warning though, he does curse in Spanish like a lot. Guys, don't be offended. A lot of people are doing pranks to each other. But from now on, I promise I'll make good content. Okay guys, thanks so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoy. Smash that like button, subscribe for more videos, and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!